Hi guys, I'm in beautiful South Australia again. It's another windy day and I've come to this house and I think we should explore it together. It's got beautiful walls out the front still, which from my experience is pretty rare. It's got a pathway leading up to it and at some stage somebody's spent it in some it's also got the stairs leading up to it still intact which is really great you can see the old wooden veranda posts let's go up the stairs look at them and scoot over here and have a look at these wooden veranda posts how stunning are they okay so the glass is gone there's an old bed down there bed frame where one of the um, posts would have been for the veranda we're up on the veranda now Another window. Now this would have been where the front door is, and obviously that's gone as well. And now we're in the entrance in the hallway. We've got a door going off to the left. Well, there's no door. <laughs> there's a doorway. Beautiful high ceilings. The ceilings are falling in, and there's wasp nests. They've got an old bed head down there. Old fireplace. Let's go in and have a look at that. The mantle is gone. I think I just discovered before that these skirtings are actually stone. Okay, coming through the beautiful hallway, the manhole up there. This is where you hung your kit. Uh, room off to the right, broken windows. Pigeon poo everywhere. Wasps nests. That's the view. And these people who lived here. This is what they would have seen. And back out of this room. You can see the damage to the wall there. Okay into the main room it's got another room off to the right and another old fireplace the doors seen better days and the windows all smashed light fittings are gone big main room lots of pigeon poo the wall coming away here now there's a window there which means they've enclosed the veranda i would imagine old fireplace that is okay going through to the room off the main room and that's got a door out onto the veranda now cool this is what i was talking about the stone skirtings which is quite interesting i haven't seen that before it's a new one for me i'm showing you from the junk that's on the floor here Bit of old carpet chairs vinyl okay let's go back out of this room back through this room don't take drugs folks <laughs> bit of vandalism Okay, the old, <laughs> I say power board, but I don't think it's quite a power board, right. What have we got here? Old stereo maybe. I'm sure I'm just getting my finger, just bear with me a sec guys. I'm just having a look at that. Kitty's dress. Okay, now look over here. This is the old bathroom, this uh, ceiling. I wouldn't give it many more days. Look, here's the old leg off the bath. Retro, retro vinyl. Here's the old bath. 
There's an old wardrobe in there. Bathroom's pretty smashed up. Imagine that's asbestos. It's the old toilet system over there. Little door there. And so that with the um, bath blocking the doorway, I won't be going in there. Let's just say to the one I love. These bits and bobs. Okay, let's go through to this room here. Oh, it's the veranda. We've got the back of a chair there. Okay, we're in. You can hear that wind again. And there's a manhole. So, yes, they have enclosed the veranda. Coming back out now, there's the bathroom in front of us. Turning towards the right, exiting the house. If you can exit it, it's sort of blocked off a little bit down that way. And they've built something else on here. Let's have a look. Let me just turn over this tin and this little shed here. Um, some clothing on the floor. Come in because the um, sun's glinting straight in my eye. Not much else there. Back out of there. There's the rainwater tank over there. Oh, goodness me. We've got more. Wow. Okay. Um, now I'm in the laundry. Is this a copper? I don't know. Look at all that, folks. How wonderful is that? What are we doing here? Stoking a fire and... That's my intrepid adventurer friend. And there's an old evaporative there. I'm going to look up for you so you can see the ceiling. It's gone in here. So another room. Wow. Oh, look at the old bed. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Wow. And what have we got? Twin tub, of course. A lot of these old homes I see have twin tubs. And then, of course, you always have to have random dead bits of things. And there's an old rolling pin. More bones. Quite sure why there'd be so many bones. But there are. It looks like an old television. An old surround of a television. Some car parts. So that's very cool. All right, okay, I am going out of this add-on to the house into a vast open space, apparently. So that's what you see when you come straight out the back. Go through this to the right. I'll turn around and back up. So just to the left there is the little one I think I went in with all the clothing. Ah, <laughs> look at this falling down in the chimney. It's the one that had the um, lid that I lifted up. All right, I don't know which way to go. It all looks so interesting. I'll go this way. There's that beautiful wall. How's that still standing strong like that after all these years? I don't know if you caught that tank. It gives you a bit of the view around here as well. That looks like a fig. Is it okay or not? Yes, I think it might be. In fact, it is. We'll be back. I don't know how old that is. There's a tank up the back there. I don't know if you caught that. Look at that view. Those hills in the background. All right, I'm going to come through the front gate. And I'm going to carefully step over this while I show you guys back in that way. That 
was a lock one day that worked. Okay, so this is a, it's like a driveway maybe. Now it's just got bits of tin and stuff laying around it with that big um, fence that I love. There we go. Alright, so that's back out to the front of the property. from around this way at the gorgeous little gem that we just drove past and I've just shared with you thanks for joining me guys I'll see you next time